to check the menu. <laughs> What's up fam, thank you so so much for stopping by the channel. Once again from us over here at Locust and Wild Honey. So on today's schedule, Neems and I took the day off from our respective duties, obligations, and occupations and decided to make a trek up to LA. We're excited, we're glad you're here. We're gonna have breakfast, we're here at Coco's, one of my favorite breakfast spots. I always say all my, all food is my favorite. I just like food a lot and it's all my favorite. <laughs> <laughs> and there's names. What's up guys? How's it going? Welcome to another video. Anyways guys, we're going up to LA. Should be a great time as always. It's always the best vlog. I always have a lot of fun uh, every time I get to go to LA. And also, Minimal invited me up to come and meet them, talk to them, discuss with them. And we'll see how that works out. Something here doesn't look right. Something here is incomplete. <laughs> much better. So we just got down to breakfast. It was so delicious. Always love Coco's. Right now we're back in the car, full bellies, intact, and then we're headed up to LA as I already mentioned. Really, really excited. We have a bit of a drive ahead of us, about an hour, but LA is well worth it. And yeah, enjoy this B-roll, enjoy some of this view, and enjoy this drive with us. Just got here to LA, super pumped because I get to meet the owner of Minimal, which is great because, as you guys know, I've had him on the channel quite a bit. Sorry, I'm crossing the street here. And they're just really great people. I've gotten to deal with all of them. Well, the ones I've gotten to, to work with, they've just been really cordial, very, very friendly and things of that nature. So very, very cool, super hyped to meet them. And yeah, gonna be taking you guys with me. How's it going? It's nice to meet you finally. What's up, man? Alright, you're live, bro. Yo, what up, Bob? Man, I fuck with you, dog. Keep doing your thing. I, I think I'm gonna start vlogging real soon one day. Shout out to my boy George, man. He's the reason why I know. He's the reason why I know about you, bro. We'll talk. So I just got done over at Minimal. It was amazing. Everybody there is so dang cool, man. Like even in person, which is awesome. That being said, we are here at the Grove. Gonna eat at Maggiano's, celebratory. Gonna eat some food. I'm starving, man. And then it's a vlog, man. Just kind of enjoy the day. Got Neems back there. And yeah, um, hopefully you guys saw like or enjoyed some of the new stuff that I, that I showed off. Those are things that I personally liked and wanted to share with you guys. Let me know in the comment section down below what you guys think. Look at this, guys. This is what I always get. Tzatziki with Alfredo and chicken. A little extra garlic. Very, very good. I have cheese. Mr. Neen's here. I got the chopped salad with bacon and blue cheese. Molded blue cheese. It's good. It's good. <laughs> All right. Let's eat. What's up guys, so we just got done with lunch. It was amazing as always. Now we're here at Fairfax. I'm gonna see what we can find. Stop by Killian, it's probably Supreme. Hopefully I can get something for Bryce while we're there. And yeah man, we're excited. I'm really stuffed. Yeah, me too. That was delicious. Definitely come to Maggiano's in the Grove. <laughs> Dude, you did that on purpose. <laughs>
What's up guys, so we just got here to Beverly Center. I don't know why we're here to be honest with you. I don't really like this mall that much, but we're here because we haven't been here for, in a while, so we see what we can do. Hopefully do an outfit challenge. I think that's, I think we're gonna try and get an outfit challenge done while we're here, hopefully. There's we cool haven't stuff. done one in a minute. All right guys, to spice up today's vlog, Nemes and I decided to do a $100 outfit challenge here at Uniqlo. We're gonna put together the best outfits that we can keeping under the hundred dollar budget and that's prior to tax so are you ready yeah get ready to get unique clothes <laughs> let's do it <laughs> and we're off okay guys so what i think i'm going to do first is just put together the top portion of the outfit and why i want to do that is because it's so easy to find pants denim whatever and we can just base it on what we off of what we do on top so let's go ahead and do that update so two things that I didn't realize is one how big unique low is there's such a broad selection of things that you could potentially get and number two I just came to the realization that this place isn't really my style at all so we're gonna have to get creative and do what we do what we can with what we have here so I mean, I'm a little worried to be honest because I've already kind of done a once over through the men's section and I really didn't find anything. So let's see what we can do. So they actually don't have a medium in this jacket. I'm gonna try the large, let's see how it looks. I actually think that the large might be a manageable. $39.99. It's on sale for $39.99. She's got a cheater right here. What are you doing, bro? What are you doing, bro? This is my region. <laughs> yeah. I like this thing, man. I like how the pockets are slightly curved. Let's take this with us. I don't know that I'm gonna use it for sure, but let's take it with us. Add this just for fun. The green, the olive and the gray might look good together. The rest of the colors are kind of whack. Pricey side at $50. But I just feel like there's no innovation to it. Like. I feel like you can use bombers anytime. And I, I guess I haven't really used bombers for the outfit challenge. Maybe I'll take one. This looks gigantor. Try the lower, smaller size. Right, let's try the next size down. Yeah, this fits much better. I actually like this. Yeah, this is nice, dude. Holy smokes, this is a pretty good quality, too. The price on here. It actually fits nice too. Yeah, 49 bucks. Chrome Francois. Is what we're using so far. And he was just trying to sabotage me and like spy and make me like put, like make me use like ugly pieces. Squirrel boy. <laughs> All right guys, so I think I found my outfit. Let's go ahead and go to the fitting room and try it on. Okay guys, so we just got into the fitting room. Have the outfits here. It's a really close quarter, so I'm gonna need to throw this stuff on do my best to, to show it to you guys. And yeah, you guys let me know what you think. You know what? Also, one thing I forgot to denote to tell you guys is that I'm dressing around my Fear Guard military sneakers as they are the only shoes I have on me at the moment. Of course, $100 here at Uniqlo would be very, very difficult to get some shoes as well. And I don't even know if they have shoes here, so let's keep going. Okay guys, so here is the outfit in its totality. Honestly, I'm not crazy about how everything fits, if I'm honest with you. The short, the shirt is a little bit short, the pants are a little bit more on the baggy end, but they're not too, too bad, to be honest. They're not like terrible, but I'm just used to wearing tighter pants. And yeah, this is, this is it, man. I was gonna put the gray with the rest of the outfit, but I thought it might be a little bit too much gray. So, here's point of view of the outfit. Look from the top. I mean, I think the green and the gray play off each other pretty well, in my opinion. It's just a very simple outfit. Very, very simple. Okay, I don't know how I feel about this at all. It looks like my PJs. But, here it is. It's different. It's unique. It's Easter. So to be transparent with you guys, I am not crazy about my outfit at all. This is probably on the more subpar side of the outfit challenge, but I was able to stay under $100, $35, $15, 
and then 50. So we're right at 100 just about, so fortunately enough I was able to do that. Anyways, I don't like the fit here. Everything runs a little bit on the smaller side, like it's for the tops. But here it is, one with a gray shirt, uh, stripes, kind of simple. Uh, then I went with the uh, olive bomber, can't really go wrong with it. Uh, everything I did was safe here because to be honest with you guys, everything's on the safer side. And then I went for these uh, pants, these, these are like joggers because it has like an elastic waistband. Oh, I like this. It's yeah, it's super light, they're comfortable, but it's not denim. So if it looks like it, that's not what it is. It's like this, it's like cotton. Yeah. So it's super comfortable. And then obviously the fear ground and the sneakers. And that's essentially the outfit. So I'm not crazy about it, but I'm not crazy about Neems either. So <laughs> I think it's okay. <laughs> so that's gonna do it for today's vlog. Hopefully you guys enjoyed it. Honestly, I felt like that was a bit like on the more lackluster side. I honestly don't feel like Unique Low is actually my forte. It's a cool store and the quality is amazing. And I would definitely buy socks and like underwear there because the, the, the Supima cotton is so nice. Yeah. Still hope you guys enjoyed it. We did our best. We really did. And yeah, man. Um, thank you for watching the vlog. Really appreciate you guys stopping by as always. And as and everybody here looks like all the time there's a cop there. Peace, be blessed.